The government has called out the national reserves as civil unrest grips the nation this evening. 41 people have been arrested island-wide today in the worst case of civil unrest to rock Jamaica in many years. Food and major commodities run low as Jamaicans remain locked inside. Several persons have been shot and injured or killed. Shortly after three, a single bullet pierced the chest of the 25-year-old expectant mother as she stood at the intersection of Grand Spen and Shorted Road. Her family was tugging at her lifeless body. Hospitals, airlines, and vendors hurting from the wounds of violent protests. A team from the IMF, which is currently in Jamaica, is wrapping up a four-day visit for a technical assessment of the country's financial situation. The issue is to make globalization work for the benefit of all. There will not be a good future for the rich if there is no prospect for a better future for the pure. The International Monetary Fund, the IMF, is urging Jamaica to reverse the declining fiscal deficit as a catalyst for economic growth. To understand the International Monetary Fund, it is best to go back to history.